How healthy is London? We're living longer, but things like obesity, smoking and poor mental health threaten our quality of life. London ranks 7th out of 14 comparable global cities. Not bad, but we can do better. Much better. Take our children, for instance. Only 3 in 5 are school ready. And when they leave primary school, 37% are overweight or obese. The Healthy Schools London programme is now helping over 725,000 children stay healthy in over 1,500 schools. By 2020, we want to ensure that all children are ready for school and see a 10% reduction in child obesity. It's not just about kids. Last year, only 57% of adults reached the recommended 2.5 hours of physical activity per week. Over 1.7 million Londoners achieved this simply by walking or cycling as part of their regular travel. We need to build on TfL's commitment to increase active travel so that 70% of Londoners achieve recommended activity levels by 2020. Tobacco kills 8,500 Londoners each year and illegal tobacco makes it easier for young people to smoke. We're working with the Met Police, London Fire Brigade and local councils to stamp out illegal tobacco and reduce smoking rates from 17% to 13%. A healthy workforce is a productive workforce, but London's economy loses almost £1 billion per year due to sick days. As the largest employer in London, the NHS will be supporting staff to stay healthy, acting as local health ambassadors in the community. Mental health is just as important as physical health. Sadly, over one million Londoners suffer from disorders like anxiety and depression. So, local councils and the NHS have invested £2.4 million into a 24-7 online mental wellbeing service for all Londoners. The first city in the world to do so. Things are changing and the health and care system is doing its bit, but we can achieve more. How can you help London be the healthiest city in the world? To find out about all of our ambitions and make a pledge, visit www.gethealthy.london and use the hashtag GetHealthyLDN.